Both the M1 Abrams tank and the Bradley fighting vehicle have been used in Army combat operations since the 1980s. Now, with the mission in Iraq shifting from combat to advising and assisting, the need for these war machines has changed. Both of these vehicles have been put on display in front of the 1st Armored Division headquarters in Camp Liberty, Iraq, to motivate the Iron Soldiers. Um, I think it's more just for the troop morale and, and the morale of the commander and I. Uh, it's always nice to kind of get back to our grassroots of uh, having tanks and Bradleys around us. The United States Division Center continues to enhance the capabilities of the Iraqi security forces by training them on the M1 Abrams tank. This provides another resource for the Iraqi security forces to use to maintain pressure on the extremist networks and protect the citizens of Iraq. 1-3 uh, currently uh, under us is training the Iraqis on M1 tanks. They, uh, they, they've purchased uh, several, several M1s and we're, we're training them how to use them. Both of these vehicles will remain in front of the 1st Armored Division headquarters until December. I'm Specialist Ben Wise. Camp Liberty, Iraq.